So this is a, a beautiful school. As you can see, it's older, but like everything I've seen in Estonia, it's always just top-notch. It's all about quality here. I mean, look at this place. It looks like a, a museum. Very, very nice. I mean, the floors are immaculate. It looks like a, like a nice hotel. So they really, really do take pride uh, into how the school is set up. I'll give you the name of the school and everything in a second, but she just wanted to finish her story with that, that they had to fight for every lesson uh, taught in Estonian when she went to university because they wanted to minimize them as well, as much as possible. So, yeah, this was like... Um, the Russians did? Yeah. Yes. Yeah, back so, in Soviet times. Yes, yeah. yeah, so they had to fight here to be able to have some lessons at the university, some lectures in their own mother tongue. So because did, the Russians dominated during the Soviet Union, they had the power. Yes, because the minister was Russian and really Russian-oriented at the right. times, and uh, yes, wanted everybody to to speak that language. Did they want people to speak Estonian at that time or no? Mm-hmm. Uh, the Estonian, uh, it was okay, but it wasn't uh, the priority. Mm-hmm. They started teaching children Russian starting from uh, the last year in the kindergarten. So at the age of five, six and up to the university. Okay. Mm-hmm. And so on the good sur ime vaike se riigi pool. Mm-hmm. Et meil on emakeelne haridus, emakeelne kõrgaridus ja nii kõrge hariduse kõrgaridus. Mm-hmm. So she's saying that this is actually a miracle that at the moment we have uh, uh, we have our own language, mm-hmm. uh, Estonian, and we have people who speak it and we 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 you can learn in that in the kindergarten, in the school and at the university level. So Ei rääkinud üldse keelte paljususest. Mm-hmm. Rääksime valdavalt vene keeles mm-hmm. ja sinna juurde siis õppekavad ka mõned inglise keele tund, mille motivatsioon muidugi oli madal, sest teadsime, et siit rauk puurist mitte kuidagi välja ei saa. Mm-hmm. And uh, back then uh, the, the learning languages were never a priority. Uh, mainly uh, you needed Russian. Uh, the, some, some schools, there were some lectures in uh, English. But learning English, the people were never motivated to do that because they knew that the borders are closed, so you can never travel outside of uh, uh, Soviet uh, Union borders to, to use your English. Mm. So, so people weren't actually motivated to learn that. And mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And through that she wants to come to the PISA uh, theme in, in that sense that Estonians have always believed that the education is really important and uh, really value that. Was the education system good under the Soviet years? Kas no kogu ajal oli haridusüsteem hea? Kindlasti mitte kõigile. Kelle jaoks hea? Aga ta võimaldas sul lõppida, ta võimaldas sul saada hariduse ja edasi liikuda ja kahtlemata ka siis avardada oma maailma. Ja tasuta võimalus sund korras sa pidi tõppi. Mm-hmm. Uh, in that sense it was good that it forced everybody to learn, uh, that it was, uh, and it was free uh, for everybody to learn, to go to school, to go compulsory, yes. and, uh, but, but also free of charge mm-hmm. to, to go to universities and to learn. So, um, uh, so in that sense, yes, they promoted the education. Mm-hmm. Ja ei olnud lapsi täna vaatel, ennad ei käinud koolis, mm-hmm. see oli enne nägematu. Sa pidid käima 12 klassi, su seljata ka seisti, mm-hmm. siis leiti kas internaatika pool, kas siis kutsetme asutus see ja see vanemate töökaudu mõjutamine. 
et sa pidi olema koolis. Mm-hmm. There were no kids that did not go to the school, so everybody needed to be at the school. So you couldn't see uh, children on the streets, teenagers mm-hmm. who are not going to the schools. But, it, but even before Soviet times, mm-hmm. was it, before Soviet Union took over, was it still valued, education valued here? Aga enne nõu kogude aega nüüd kas haridus nagu hinnati. Väga. Mm-hmm. Esimese Eesti valitsuse aeg väga. Ja nüüd ma jõuangi selle meie kooli ja meie kooli ajal on mm-hmm. uh, Yes, the education was really valued during the first independence of Estonia. Uh, which started uh, at the beginning of the last century. Mm-hmm. And, uh, and through that she, she would just get to the history of this school. Okay. Mm-hmm. Um, and now she will say the name. Mida te nüüd küsisid, me oleme juba pool ajalub ära <laughs> rääkinud. Et mina olen Urue Krause ja Pärnu Kuninga tänava põhikooli direktor. Mm-hmm. So what is the name of the school? Uh, she just named it. Ja but, meie kooli no, nimetus on Pärnu Kuninga tänava põhikooli. Mm-hmm. Do you want it more clearer? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Kas te saaksite öelda seda? Will she say it so you want? No, go ahead. Kuninga tänava põhi. Yeah. Okay. And and it's a basic school. This yeah, is a basic school. school. One through nine. Uh, one until the nine. And grade. how many kids are in the school? This is the least taste. Uh, Five hundred and fifteen kids. Oh wow. Mm-hmm. Ja selle skooli hoones oli eh, võrdluste gümnaasi. 1875 ehitatud ja siin õppisid siis Eestile väga olulised inimesed. Terve vabarik esimene valitsus, kultuuritegelased, poliitikud, kirjanikud, mm-hmm. eh, harstid mm-hmm. ja nendest kasvasid siis välja Eesti haridluskud. Mm-hmm. Kas ma kuulsin õigest, et see poiste kõrvalt? Poiste kõrvalt. The school started in... Uh... 1875 mm-hmm. and it was only school for boys and all the Estonian, uh, the higher class, the elite came from here, um, a lot of them, uh, like uh, politicians, uh, doctors, uh, etc. So it started from here. Ja nende väärtused ja kasvatus oli vaba Euroopa mõtlemine ja elamine vabas riigis ja väärtused olid oma keel, oma riik, oma riigi ehitamine. Mm-hmm. Uh, so the orientation of the way of thinking in the school, what they really uh, were all about was uh, the uh, freedom of the country, freedom of the people, uh, loving your country, your language, promoting your uh, culture and language, um, which was Estonian. And, uh, so that's uh, that's what they really strongly did did here. Mm-hmm. How what? How about the class class uh, sizes?